Well, it occurs to me maybe you want to know how I sharpened this. If you have this kind of Forstner bit, I've found that it's not important to sharpen these at all. Plus, plus they don't get dull. I, I guess they do, but these are these are pokey sharp. I'll tell you right now. All you need to do is sharpen this. These two cutters. You only really need to sharpen the flat part right here. And how do you do that? The easiest way, I'll, I'll show you here and then I don't know if you'll see it as well once I get it in the chuck. But all you have to do is go like this with your diamond card. And then I guess it doesn't hurt and I, I did do it on the other, on the smaller one. Then a couple of passes up here after you've done this. Just a couple of passes. That made all the difference in the world. The easiest way is to put it in the chuck. Get a get a place that's comfortable for you to use. For me, that's right about there. Put a little honing oil on your diamond card. Doesn't take much, just a couple of drops. Spread it around. Just lay it flat on there. And just run it back and forth. And then when you're done, couple of strokes this way, get it on that bevel, nice and flat on that bevel, and a couple of strokes that way, and you'll have sharpness here. You'll just be pleased at the outcome. Oh yeah, see, already, already. It just doesn't take much with a diamond card. And then I think it's important to wipe that uh, honing oil off of your bit. You don't want to get the inside all oiled up before you sand it and finish it and all that. So be sure you get any excess off of there. I think we are ready to begin. Here's a little tip that I learned on accident. Sometimes these bits can be really hard to get out of the chuck no matter how hard I turn. And I'm an old guy so I don't have the muscles I used to have but even if I put a glove on here and try and turn this to get that out of there, can't do it. I just can't do it. So I grab my strap wrench. A lot of people are familiar with a strap wrench. It's usually a plumbing item. This happens to be a rigid and that just makes it easy peasy. So if you get in that situation, there you go. Easy peasy. It's, this just gets tighter and tighter in use is the problem.